If you want to find out what a loop is, because I do, I'm here with Gary Barnett from Barney's, uh, and it's uh, we're talking about different things within the print industry just to help me understand a little bit more, and, and you as well. So can you tell us, Gary, what is a loop and what is it used for within printing? Okay, well, a, a loop, or otherwise known as an eyeglass, effectively is this. It's, it's, it's effectively a magnification tool. It's just... It's essentially a magnifying glass, and and what it, what it does, I mean, we can tell a lot through this. It simply magnifies anything. So I've got a, an example of a of a book that we've printed, a, a school a yearbook, and by, by simply placing that on the on the printed surface and and, and looking through it, you you can actually see the dot. I'll, I'll let you have a look. Mm-hmm. Look, David, have a look. You can actually ah. see the dot. That tells us a lot about how how the the job has actually been printed, yeah, whether yeah. it's been done as a CMYK or a four color process print job. When there are solid areas on a print job, it, it actually shows up as a, as a pure solid. So we, to the naked eye, you can't see that. By, by looking through this, we can determine this may be necessary in helping a customer. Hey guys, I've got a brochure, would love you to print it. Don't really understand the, the inks that have been used. Can you help us? We can look through one of these. The other thing is when we see poor quality printing, it's often what's called out of register. And that is, it looks a little bit like a 3D movie. You're mm. looking at it, but it just doesn't look sharp. Yeah. It's looking a bit blurry. You don't quite know why. When you put a magnification tool on it, you can actually see that the ink hasn't been overlaid on top of each other. The, the colours have to be overlaid perfectly in perfect registration on top of each other for it to be a sharp image. And yeah. if it's been printed poorly, there's movement in the sheet, there's movement in the printing press, and it doesn't happen. And to the naked eye, you just know it doesn't look good, but you don't know why. Yeah. By using one of these, it shows up everything. So it's a really... I don't go anywhere without it. And it's a wonderful tool to have. And it's just a little thing that we have in our toolkit that helps us get perfect printing. Perfect. If you want to find out more about how you can get perfect printing, why don't you check out Barney's? Just visit the website or give the number on the screen a call.